Bitmapping TV. Hi, my name is Tino and I'm a Bitnapper. Today I will show you an application which I would say I have to use many, many times a day because I can't live without this application. Usually, if you're going to open an application, you will open your finder and click on the Applications folder and then you will check for the application like the Firefox I would like to use now. So another way to do this is searching using Spotlight. So I click Command Space and search for Firefox. So I get the Firefox which I can open now. Another way to do this is using Quicksilver. And Quicksilver you can download from blacktree.com. So you click on Quicksilver and click on the download button. Click on OK. And now you have to mount the DMG to your desktop. You know how to install applications, don't you? So after the DMG has been mounted to your desktop, you have to take this application file and put it into your applications folder. So now we're going to open Quicksilver. And we will be reminded that we have downloaded the file from the internet and we click on open to accept this. Here we are. So I click on continue, I accept the terms of the license and I can install a few more plugins which we will see in a later show. I click on continue and now I have to set up a hotkey for the use. I prefer using control space and I have to set up the time after which I would like to rescan my catalog. So I take 10 minutes and I click on continue, once more continue, finish. So now I have this window here and all I can do now is typing in the application's name or the name of a file or different things. So I try it again, I'd like to open iChat, so I put in ICH and I see now iChat as first pick and I also get many different picks which also have an I and C and an H in it. And now to open iChat, I just hit return and iChat opens. So to get the window back, I use the hotkey, control space, and here I am. So if I don't like this view, I can change it by opening the preferences. And here, if I click on appearance, I can change from primer to bezel. It looks a lot better. So now I open it again by using the hotkey, and here we are, the bezel interface. Quicksilver is very, very strong, so I only show you how to use it for searching applications, but you can do a lot more. You can set up hotkeys for everything you want to do. So that's it for today. I'm Tino and I'm a bitnapper. If you would like to become a bitnapper, send us an email to ransom at bitnapping.tv. Thank you for watching. Be a bitnapper. Email your tips to ransom at bitnapping.tv.